Welcome trainers and champions to another episode of Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke Season 2! Yes, we are back again. And in the last episode we went off against Top again and the Sword and Shield twins. And we faced off against the first um Rabid or Savage Gigantamax Pokemon or Dynamax Pokemon. Um, I'm not sure what you would call it. I guess a rampage, I suppose. I guess maybe. Um, but yeah, so now I think in today's episode we're gonna be looking at getting rid of all of the um, rampaging Dynamax Pokemon and just get rid of all of them so then hopefully you know we get to um, we get to Zamazenta by next episode so th this one's pretty much gonna be clean up of the region more or less um, so hopefully we do say um, hopefully we do get rid of all of them in one go it's gonna be a lot of quick traveling it's gonna be a lot of you know going around planning the team out and stuff like that um, of course guys if you guys still want to see the rules the rules are always in the description if you guys want to check out the rule set um, Okay, cool. So we can oh, so it's pretty oh never mind. We got to go to Stoke and hold Cool, so that means Kabu and Nessa which shouldn't be that bad to be honest We can do this we can this should be pretty fine So if we do Kabu's one first we should probably put up our Katara our Katara the Gastrodon as our upfront one turn ground, we've got double type advantage, which should be cool to be honest. So yeah, we should have a pretty decent advantage. Once we get that though, we'll um, yeah, we'll get rid of Kabu, and then we'll go to Nessa's gym. We'll get rid of Nessa's gym, and then I think the rest of that is I think we got Alistar afterwards. So once we do Alistar afterwards, then God, who's after that? Um, it would be I can't even remember who would be after. Who's after Alistar? Oh my gosh, I can't even remember. Um, gosh, who is after Alistar? It's not Melanie. Melanie's not for a long time. Um, Opal? I think it is Opal. It has to be Opal, right? It's got to be Opal. So Opal is after that. And then after Opal, then is Melanie. Then is Marnie's gym. But I don't know what exactly it would be on, um, on Spike Myth. And then Raihan's gym, and I don't know who the dragon type is in Raihan's gym either. So it might be a ground type, maybe? Because for some reason, Raihan just has ground type. I said this before, in, like back when we did the Nuzlocke beforehand when we faced Raihan. Dude, Raihan to me is just a straight up. He's a ground type specialist. He's not. He, he, there's no way he's a dragon type specialist. Half of his team are ground, and half of his team are dragon. And it's just like, just, dude, why? Um, right, I think maybe Max got wait what what damage? Oh, it's literally the same. Heavy rain, yeah, sure, why not? Um powers up hop a little bit as well, so yeah, we should be pretty good. We should be pretty decent. Right, let's roll. Let's go Gastrodon, let's go Katara! Katara coming in swinging! Oh, dude, how are you guys doing today? Actually, I'm not doing too bad. I've been um, well, I've actually been excited to keep this going. I'm actually so excited to do the final matchup with Hop. I'm so I'm so happy. Like I said in the last episode, um, I was so excited to just um, uh, I feel like the end of the game is literally us facing Hop because it, it kind of felt right. Like you faced Hop when you didn't have any Pokemon, and then you've got your best team against him. It just feels right in my perspective. So that's why we're doing season two for everyone who's like coming in now. Um, so yeah, it just felt like a right kind of idea so hopefully we do you know we do well hopefully we do well I'm I think the one that I'm worried about the most is probably um, I think the one that, um, the matchup that I'm worried about the most is probably the last match against shield but I, I think and for some reason that's got me so worried and I'm not exactly sure as to why but I remember it being somewhat tricky so hopefully we do get a good matchup in. Hopefully, hopefully we do give him a good run for his money. Um, we kind of faced him off the first time. We came through with no casualties, which was great. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm pretty confident that we can do that. We can do fairly well in this. So yeah, I think that's the main match to worry me. Obviously, Hop is Hop is going to be harder because Hop's going to be using Zacian, and as part of our rule set, we're not using Legendary, so we're not using Zamazenta, which is going to be very worrying for me. Um, but I feel like Itachi would probably be the best run against Zacian. Um, since Zacian is part fight- oh no, it's Steel and Fairy. Zamazenta Steel and Fighting. Um, so Fairy types don't affect Ghost types, which is a good plus for us. And 
Um, we've, we're part fire, so the steel we can we can pick at his steel typing, which is again good for us. Oh no, I went completely in. I didn't swap out the Pokemon. Oh, I didn't swap out Katara. Oh no, I'm so sorry, Katara. You're gonna go through another fight. On the plus side, she didn't get hit, so that's something for us. Oh my god, I completely didn't swap out Katara. I had the whole plan set. I was like, yeah, we could bring in, bring in Zeus. Zeus could do cool. Or bring in Snurple as well. Snurple do cool. Didn't even give us the option to wait. Didn't even give us an option. Either that or I really skip past it. And that way I'm twice as dumb. Right, a Gyarados. Okay, I mean, we have an ice type move, which is fine. I, He shouldn't know any grass type moves. Emphasis on shouldn't, but probably would. Maybe I don't see him learning any grass type moves though. What what move would he even know? There's nothing really. There's no grass type moves that he could possibly know, right? Um, not like it. Not I'm aware of. Nothing that I'm aware of that he knows. So we got icy wind. So this should be pretty cool. So uh, it's something. It's super effective. Something. It's better than doing neutral slash no damage. So I mean, it's 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 the best we got to be honest. At least we got snow for the hail. Yeah, it hits everybody else, but they're not doing a mud lock. We are so. That's fine. Right, let's go. I think in terms of leveling as well, we're pretty much on a good level. I think, if anything, we're over-leveled. I think. Um, oh, that makes things so much better for us. Oh, that makes things so much better for us. But yeah, I think... Um, I think we're actually over-leveled for this, for this little part. Which is kind of a good thing. I, I've not actually seen... Um, seen Hop's, like, final team... So I'm not exactly sure if he's got like a big, big chunky Pokemon like us that's got like level 60 plus. So I'm not too sure, but I feel like he doesn't. I feel like he doesn't. Like if anything, he hits the 60s, but nothing close after that. Right, yeah, unfortunately we do chip at everybody else and ourselves. So that's a bit of a self-sacrifice. I was not expecting to do a... a Dynamax move that would also hurt us in the process was not expecting that, but that's fine Okay, storm drain just literally helps us on that point That's fantastic. I'm literally not complaining about that. I will fully take that Right, I think this max hailstorm is probably gonna take up. It's probably gonna give us the win It's a good thing we attached icy wind. Why did I even do that? Why did I I attached icy wind here? Oh um, Gastro doesn't have rain dance before, but why did I get rid of rain dance? There was a, uh, there was a reason. There's a reason that I got rid of rain dance, and I can't remember why. I really can't remember. There's a reason that I put on rain dance. Oh no, there's a reason I took it off. I mean, I should have kept it. I don't understand why I took it off. It's such a good move for Katara. It just makes everything bulkier. So I'm not, I'm not exactly sure, but I, I guess there's some reason. I don't know if I said it in the last episode or an episode before. Oh, my phone's ringing. My phone's ping, ping, pinging, ring a ling, ling. -y. Right, in the lab. Um, they keep really demanding. I have the wishing stars. I'm more right for now, but okay, cool. Oh, is it the two guys? Okay, cool. So if that's the case, then I will probably have to swap over. I guess Snurple will probably be the best one. I guess Snurps would have to be the best idea. Right, cool. First, let's swap them over first, so we don't get confused. Um, should I do should I do Snurps? Should I do Zeus or Itachi? Itachi would probably be a good a good shout to go first. Actually, let's do Itachi first. We'll do Itachi first, and then obviously we'll because if it's Shield Bird, that means he's gonna start off with the Far Fetched or Surf Fetched because we did Surf Fetched. Um, is there anything is there anything else that I should be worried about? I don't know Shield. I don't know Soul Bird's Pokemon. That's the only problem. I have no idea what Sorbert's Pokemon is going to be. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm completely stuck. So I might try and snipe for his. I know he starts, I know Hop starts off with a double. And as much as that would be fun, his Surfetch is going to completely run through it. Or Shieldbert's uh, Surfetch is going to completely run through it. So that's fine. But I, I think I'm going to try and put more emphasis on Sorbert. Just because I don't know what his Pokemon are. Um, but we've seen shield Burts before, so this is fine. This is fine. We can completely do this, right? So, more story, more story, and I'm guessing we do a team battle, right? Yeah, cool. We do a team battle with Hop. That's fine. 
That's completely fine. Let's roll. And I'm guessing that we fight them one more, either one more or two more times. I think. Oh, Glycopod. Okay, cool. So water, okay, cool. Water damage, cool. Oh no, I just realized, I thought I'm starting off with Zeus. Oh no. Um, we might have to be very careful. And they're level 62. Okay. Um, we could probably tank a hit. But then I should probably swap out to Zeus. Because if he's going to do a water move. Yeah, if he's going to do a water if, Zeus, if they're going to do a water move, then Zeus can use dry skin to use it for healing. So that way we don't lose anything. Um, okay, if not unless they target double first. Okay, cool. Um, for Bronzong, I'm not too worried. It's more that Golisopod, because that Golisopod can have stuff that can really take us out. So I'm not too fast. Um, I'd probably do Thunderbolt first to... Or should I do Volt Switch? No, just do Thunderbolt for now. Do Thunderbolt for now. If it's going to be a really challenging Pokemon, then do Volt Switch. Cool, nice. That's super effective. Nice, 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 nice. We got this, we can do this. Right, Katara went 67. That's cool. Right, this isn't going to be very effective, so Hop's probably going to lose his bronze on, most definitely, if it's not going to be another status C type condition. Um, or it's not going to hit me, but most likely they're going to hit Hop, which is fine. Again, Hop's not doing a Nuzlocke, we are, that's fine. I'm completely happy with that. I was about to say, I was, that was no way that, that was his Inteleon. Okay, Dewblade. Uh, Ghost and Steel, which means I will probably do Vault Switch. Oh no, Bulldoze? Would Bulldoze be better? But then I hit his Inteleon in the process. I'm most likely some of them would have Levitate, so I'm not going to do that. I'm going to do... I'm going to hit the Bronzong, and I'm probably going to Vault Switch into... Ah, uh, see, I could do... Ugh. I could do Rock Lee, but then Steel Typing is going to hit me. I could do... Or I could do Katara. Katara would probably be better, to be honest. Yeah, Katara would be better. It's got Earth Power. We can use Earth Power to get rid of both of them. That should be fine. We, we should be okay. Oh, ooh, nice crit from Hop. Where was that? What was that? That was incredible. That was really good. Right, Extensory, who's it going to hit? Inteleon, that's fine. Right, Bishop. Okay, cool. So, Dark and Steel, we should be okay still. We're still fine. Right. Okay, so I'm guessing Bishop was... Oh! Oof! Inteleon's almost going to go. And he knows Levitate. Okay, cool. Well, that confirmed it then for me. Um, cool, Katara dodged it. That's fine. Might as well... Should I set up a rain dance? Let's set up rain dance. But we're gonna go last with it, which means that... Oh, you turn! Wow, check out Hop using all of his retreating moves. Check that out! That's pretty that's a pretty decent strat. Knowing that you're faster, retreating out first, that's actually fairly decent. Nice shout, Hop. Right, and at this point, his snipe shot should be stronger by the time he comes out, if he brings it out by that point. Right, cool. Then use Muddy Water again. Um, I'm guessing the rain gives us extra HP if we ever get hit, which is fine. Light Swing is worn off, which is also fine. Muddy Water is also fine. It doesn't actually hit our partner's Pokemon, which is great. Right, Night Slash is probably going to take him out. Yep, I thought so. I need to get rid of the Bronzong before it does any damage, but Bronzong's probably going to be faster than me by the tiniest amount. And But never mind, he avoided it, which sucks. Nah, dang, dude, that Bronzong's becoming a problem. That Bronzong is such a mad problem. Don't put me to sleep. Ah, oh, I'm going to have to retreat out. Okay, so what's his moveset? Hypnosis, Extrasensory, Light Screen, and there's one more hidden move that I've not seen yet, which is actually very troubling. Um... I'm not gonna put any Tachi because he can still do Night Slash on me, so I'm not gonna do that. Um, so most likely, I'm just gonna put in. We won't really have much of a choice but to do Rock Lee, to be honest. I just hope that they don't have any Steel type moves. If they have Steel type moves, we could 
prob we might lose Rock Lee today. Oh my gosh, saying that it actually puts so much fear in my heart. Right, U turn again. It's fine, I suppose. Took out Bronzong with it, but can you retreat to anybody else? That's kind of all. Oh no, he's still got Snorlax and stuff, right? But never mind, he loses Inteleon. Oh no, he doesn't use anyone else. He only uses double Inteleon and Corviknight. That's it? Okay, four links as well. Oh, four links! Oh no. That means I'm, I'm on my own. Ah, oh, that's gonna suck. Um, and I'm on my own. Oh no. Because Hop decided to be. Oh god, we could probably lose him today. No, okay, cool. He can take a hit. He takes a hit very well. So that was. 100 damage, let's say. 102. 102 damage. Oh my god, and they're both faster. Right, get out Bishop and then swap over immediately to probably. Okay, so he's already done first impression. Well. First impressions wouldn't be as powerful now because it only works when Four Links comes out, not when we bring another Pokemon out. So that's fine. Um, or bring out Tachi. Now that we've got rid of all of his Dark types and stuff, bring out Tachi. This would be cool. So most likely he's got Four Links. I think that the last Pokemon to bring out is Surfetched, only because that's the only Pokemon I remember him having, apart from these two. All right, and the rain has stopped. Perfect timing. Um, I'm gonna do. What, a flat out overheat? Overheat could probably take him in one go. His special defense is trash. He didn't use no retreat. Cool. Nice. Um, only problem is our special attack goes down. We could probably swap in and back out. If we swap in... If it's not Surfetch, we can swap in Zeus, do um, Volt Switch and come back out. Kling Clang. Okay, cool. No, we can take a Kling Clang. We can take Kling Clang. One more overheat and we should take him. I'm fine with that. One more, one more. Over oh, unless you do that. Unless you do that. Right. Maybe try fire spin. Let's try fire spin instead. He shouldn't know anything that's that's that crazy, right? And of course, he avoided it as well. Shift gear raises his speed. Speed and special attack, or is it just speed? Speed and attack. Okay, cool. I thought it was speed and special attack. Which is fine. Let's do Confuse Ray, actually. Let's go with Confuse Ray, just to give us a bit more breathing space. Um, but, of course, if he goes first, then that's a bit of a problem. Okay, that does, what, 50... No. 77 damage. Okay, cool. And he hurt himself as well. He's got burnt as well, because of Flame Body, which is fine. I'm completely fine with that. And Confusion as well at the same time. Cool. Um. So, that w so Wild Charge was 77. Crit... 144 so that could kill Snurps I'd probably bring in Snurple Steel typing wouldn't really do much Electric typing wouldn't do much either And I can brick brick straight afterwards Higher accuracy, super effective We can probably take him out in this one go Cool, we should be alright Okay cool, it wasn't a crit If it was, oh wow that was a crit So we could have lost Tachi on that one Oh, good thing we swapped it's a good thing we swapped out, because that probably would have killed Itachi. Most likely that would have killed. Right, we should be fast. We're not even faster. Okay, cool. It hurt himself. That's perfect. We got it now. We can do this. Gone. Cool. Oh, man. That was close. That was super, super close. If we didn't do it then, if if we didn't swap out then, we probably would have lost Itachi. Yeah, dude. Shilba is actually quite trouble. Um, oh gosh, and I'm still worried about Hop's Zacian when he uses it. If he uses, um, if he uses his signature move, we could probably, he could most likely sweep. But then again, he can only use it five times, so give and take. Right, cool. Okay, so now that that's done. Um, it's been dangerous. Be careful. Triple that, triple that, triple that. Hey, that sounds like a song. Triple that, triple that, triple that. Hey, triple that, triple that. Oh, I love it. I love it. That should be a song. I'm surprised that's not. There's so many. There's so many things over something. Else. Wait, she gave her wishing stars. That she gave him. Dy they gave him things to Dynamax for. Why would you do that? Wait, did they trade the sword? They traded the rusted sword for. It's not helping it. It's necessary for the plan. Our plan to put Galen. Oh wow, she just. Everyone just let her give it to them. 
Betrayal. You let them be betrayed. No one decided to stop. Right, cool. Head outside. Oh, here we go. It's, the, it's going to be the end of the world, isn't it? So that means... Oh, God. Who's this going to be... Who's gonna be his Gigantamax? He doesn't have anyone that that, that Gigantamax is, right? Shilba? He, he shouldn't do, right? He had, um, Kling Clang, Four Links, um, Surf Edge, Bronzong, um, and who is his fifth? He had five, he didn't have six, but who... Who was his sixth? Um, who was his fifth? Um, I can't actually remember. It's a dynamite. Oh, okay. I can't actually remember who his team was. Okay, well that's fine. We'll figure it out when we get there. I'm not gonna try and. Uh, I, I did say last episode I want to keep it exciting for myself, so I'm not gonna see what team he had. I'm not gonna try and look and see what team they have. The best I know is Hop because Hop's team never changes. Um, but Shieldbert's team does give me a run for my money, but I'm gonna keep it that way. I'm gonna I'm gonna just leave it the way it is because I'm actually okay. I feel like our team's okay. Like we're we're hitting the same level as them now. We don't want to over level too much. So I'm just keeping the team that we have for now. So yeah, we should be okay. Right, first off, definitely heal. Definitely heal. Right, let's go. Chantelor, Snurps, Zeus, Rockley, Katara, and Big Mom. Right. So next up is Alistair's gym, which he should probably have a, I want to say Mimikyu, but that doesn't feel right. Is it a ghost type that they don't use? Um, should we just go up along the map? I feel like we should just go up a lot. Yeah, might as well just go up along the map. Cool. Once we do all these, um, I might split these up if we're just quick traveling all over the place. So if we do cut out, it's probably going to be just to the last one. But um, if not, then we've just got the rest of these four. Oh. Hey Sonia, what are you doing? Oh, Kiketu. Someone saw someone saw those sword and shield widows. They said they've gone through the door. But the door's closed and let you lock. Open it might take some time. Oh, so when I when I'm done doing what I'm doing. And I've just gone in blindsided without doing Oh god, I'm so stupid. I've just gone in blindsidingly doing it without changing Pokemon or even getting ready. Oh, I'm such a dummy. Oh, yes, cool. Um Oh, never mind. I, it, both of them are just yes. It's yes in two very different ways. It's either yeah or affirmative. There's no in-between. Cool, that means I'm gonna have to switch, which is great. I'm hoping that it's someone that we've got advantage for. Who was up front? Itachi, right? Itachi was up front. So please let it be someone that we can use. It's a Haxorus. Oh, crap. Does he know any dark I don't think so. Katara would have been perfect because it has ice. It's got an ice Dynamax. Um, oh my god, are we on our own? We're on our own. Oh god. Um, okay. Right. Lowers the target's defense. That doesn't really help me, but that's fine. Okay. We're just gonna have to go. We're just gonna have to go Pokeballs deep in it. Ah. Uh, we're just gonna have to go. We're just gonna have to go all in, if because if I swap out, I lose my Dynamax, and that means I'm just in so much trouble. Oh, I'm a bit. I'm a, oh, I'm a tiny, tiny bit worried because I feel like if he's got a Dark type move, we're screwed. Max quit. Oh no, but he's got a Ground type move as well. That's gonna be just as bad, and he's faster, which doesn't help me. I'm gonna lose Itachi. Oh my god, I'm gonna lose Itachi. Wait, can I swap? I think I can. I think I could probably make a swap. Oh, that is damaging. No. But I'm slower. That is a big point. I'm slower. I might have to just change into Big Mum. He's probably going to do Max Quake again, which works for us. Um, we're definitely not going to be stronger. We are not, I mean faster. We're not going to be faster. I want to try and use Blizzard, but if we miss, we're screwed. Iron Tail, why? Oh yes, Big Mom, you avoided it. Yes. Right, if I can do, if Big Mom can just tank one Iron Tail, we should have it. If it hits, Bli if we hit Blizzard, we've got it straight away. Cause that Shadow Ball did a lot. Oh no. Oh no. We're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die. No, we didn't, we survived. We survived. Come on, 
Big Mom, please, just one shot, just one shot. That's all I need, just hit it, just hit it. And it avoided it. That was our one shot, and it's gone now. Um, does steel, is still super effective against ground? Yes, it is, isn't it? Um, still super effective against rock. He's got a ground type move, so our last call is literally Snurps. That's our last shout. Otherwise, we've got a, we've just got a sink of Pokemon. Right, earthquake that does nothing. That's fine. We ca come on. We are we faster? Are we even faster than? A See, he's got higher attack, but boom burst does more. Let's just do both. I'm not gonna one shot him anyway, so let's just do both. Okay. Okay. It's not what I was expecting, but that's fine. So he's got iron. So he's got max steel. To Giga impact. Will that do a lot? Oh, okay, that will do. That was a crit. Right. Um, oh my god, it all comes down to if I can, if I can do. If boom burst is a one shot, then that's great. But I don't know if it is. I really don't know if it is. Um, I've got no idea. I have absolutely no idea if it's a crit or not, or if it will one shot it or not. If I do this, and it doesn't kill Haxorus, we've lost snaps. Um, unless I unless I choose a Pokemon to sink, unless I choose someone to sink. Um, Katara's done me well, but I feel like Iron Tail or Max Steel Spike will probably kill me. It will probably kill me. Considering that it's also very, very slow. Um, it's most likely going to use iron, a steel type move after this as well. <sighs> it's most likely going to use... I don't see him using Earthquake. But then again, I also do see him using Earthquake. Or Max Steel Spike. Or Max Quake. Ugh, this is gonna be tough. Right, I've got faith. Wait, how much damage does Icy Wind do? And how accurate is it? 95. I'm gonna have to choose a Pokemon to sink. I'm gonna have to choose a Pokemon to sink. Ah, oh, this is gonna be tough. If it's Iron, if it's gonna do an Iron type move or Steel type move, we're screwed. Oh yes, no, because it did get an impact, didn't it? Oh, that gives us a free slot. I completely forgot that it did. Uh, I completely forgot it did Giga Impact. We tank that. We take those. We take those. Katara, you just need to hit. You just need to hit it. You just need to hit it. That's all we need to do. Just hit it. Just hit it. That didn't kill. That didn't even kill. But its speed fell. Will we be far? I don't think we'll. There's no way we're going to be faster than the Hagsaurus. There is absolutely no way. There is absolutely no way we're going to be faster than the Hagsaurus. No chance. Um, can I swap out to anybody else without dying? Most likely not. I don't really want to lose Katara though, to be honest. Who am I facing up against? That's that's going to be really good for Katara. Um, with her ice type move. I mean... Damn it, man. This is going to be tough. Um, I'm just really scared of Earthquakes. If I do Earthquake and bring in either Zeus or Rock Lee, they're going to die. They are going to die. One's times four weak, and one is extremely weak in general. Um, oh, I, don't really, I don't really want to get rid of Itachi because he's going to do me so well against um, against Sorbert. Or against Shilbert. Um, if I had to pick one. If I had to pick... I hope that I baited him to do a steel type move. Because if he does a steel type move, like Iron Tail or something, we are so set. Max Ring Wind. Ah, oh, Tachi, I'm so sorry, my guy. I'm so sorry. Tachi, I'm so sorry. Right. Oh, Tachi, I'm so sorry, dude. I'm so sorry. Oh, Tachi, I'm so sorry. Ah, oh, that hurts. 
We're still losing people, even all this way. Um, Snapple can be faster, but I don't trust Boom Burst enough to do a solid hit. I could do Volt Switch, but then that's probably going to kill me even more. I'm just going to go for all our Bulldoze. There's no way that he's... Yeah, cool. Bulldoze kill! Oh my god. With, there's no way. There is no way. I should have just done Boom Burst. Why did, I, why did I hesitate with that? I should have just done Boom Burst. Earthquake's going to kill... Outrage? Oh god, yeah, that's going to kill... Oh no! It survived! He survived! Oh god, am I gonna have to sacrifice somebody else? Oh, there's no way. Am I gonna have to sacrifice someone else? Oh my god, there is no way. There is absolutely no way. Um, it's a fat gamble. It's a fat, fat gamble. But I don't think he would use oh it's a fat gamble but I might just I might put in rock Lee but then that's such a big gamble oh, I'm in such a bad spot I could sack um, big mum I could just sack big mum that could probably work actually I could sack big mum and then just do um, snurple to do boom burst just one quick boom burst. That should boom burst should kill. If boom burst doesn't kill, I'll be so freaking upset. I'll be so incredibly upset because that would have been our far, the, arguably our fastest one besides Zeus. But Zeus cannot do anything in this in this raid. I until okay, cool. Yeah, we lost Big Mom too. That sucks. That absolutely stinks. We could have had it if she hit the Blizzard. If she hit Blizzard, we would have had it. Right, Snurple was faster. I don't know for a fact. It's just whether or not boom burst will kill. And I feel like it should. Cool, we got it. Oh man, that sucks. That absolutely sucks. That absolutely sucks. Right. Oh man. Go okay, on the on on a silver lining, we did have Pokemon prepared. I'm not too upset. Actually, okay, I'm upset with Itachi, dude. I'm so upset that we lost Itachi from this. I'm so upset. Oh my god, why did no one help me with that? Lend a hand, you lended no hands. Oh, if I had a team behind me, I could have actually got it. Damn it, man. Damn it. Oh, man. We do have backup Pokemon, though. But Itachi, Itachi got me so sad. Atachi got me so so sad man. I am so upset with that. That is that was a fat blow to take. Oh no, Itachi, big mom, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Damn it man, I am so sorry. Right. Oh, gosh, right, we set up our Charizard. Oh, Itachi, I'm so sorry, dude. You gotta go with the other. Look at our team. look at how many of us died. Look at how many of us died. That would have been so cool for this journey. Oh man, it's amazing. Even in even when we think that we're sorted, we're still so we can still get one like completely blindsided. And here I thought Hax Haxorus would have been easy. Haxorus should have been easy. When we had our Haxorus, it just wasn't good at all. But ah, oh, god, dude, we ah, oh, such a heartbreaking thing to see. I can't believe we lost the Tachi. That actually. There's a chunk of my heart missing. I'm more upset that we've lost the Tachi than Big Mom. Big Mom came in late. I didn't really get much time to attach to Big Mom. But I'm so upset that we lost the Tachi. The Tachi was there from us since more or less like very early in the journey as well. They was there with us so early in the journey. But we should probably give introductions to our brand new two. We have Embor or Ember, 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 the Charizard that we got at the end of, after defeating Leon, um, it's pretty, pretty decent, and we actually have a Gigantamax Pokemon now, which is cool, um, decent moveset, in my opinion, probably could be better, but it's what we have, and of course we have Colter, the Vulture, the Mandibuzz, um, which, again, has pretty cool stats as well, which also helps us with the next one, which I think is gonna be Alistar, which I think is gonna be Alistar, but I think we've ran that time now, so I think we're going to get through the last four gyms afterwards, which is fine. I was not expecting the match with, um, I was not expecting the dual match, and I was not expecting Haxorus to be that tough. So unfortunately, that's all we have.
Oh, that sucks. That absolutely stinks. Absolutely stinks. I am so upset with that. That should not have happened. That should not have happened. Oh, I failed, I failed Itachi so bad. And Big Mom. I failed Itachi and Big Mom so badly. But we have no choice but to progress and move. We So we advance. So, next up is Alistair's gym. I'm not sure what the ghost typing is. But before we do that, because this is kind of what also screwed us over as well. Colter goes up on top. Um, I'm not exactly sure what the Pokemon is going to be. I can't even remember what exactly it could be. So, we're just going to leave it like that, guys. So, thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, in the next episode, we should clear out the last four gyms. We've got Alistar. We've got Opal or Bead's gym. I think we rematch Bead as well. So, that's going to be fun. Um, we have Melanie's gym. And I think... Where's the last gym? The remaining four gyms. But we should be... What? Well, it should be Spike Myth, right? It should be Spike Myth. Should be the last one, but there's no exclamation point. Um, unless we just get rid of these three and then Spike Myth's the last one. And then we just move on after that. But anyways, that's kind of how it goes. So yeah, so next episode we should clear um, Alistar. We'll have a rematch against Bead, which hopefully shouldn't kill us that badly. I, I hope not, because I'll be so upset. We've got our last final rematch against Bead the Destroyer, which honestly I'm not looking excited for now. And we have... Uh, Melanie's gym to also get rid of which I'm actually looking confident about so thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys enjoy and if you guys enjoyed always click like and always leave another video or well, always leave a like and always click on another video guys always welcome back I messed up my outro and of course I will see you guys in the next video right guys take care and I'll see you all later okay bye